Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Today, I would like to talk about PADL Manager of Windsor to SAPDOT, a detection and unwanted program that you may have seen in your system. It is a rather unusual type of unwanted application that has become massively widespread lately. In this video, I will explain how dangerous it is and how to remove it. Starting with the definition, PUADL Manager Winsor Tutor SAPDOT, as I said, is a detection and unwanted program, specifically a bundler. Bundlers are small code pieces that piggyback on installers of different software and aim at installing other applications. Overall, that tactic is known as software bundling and is mainly used by the developers of free software and pirates for monetization purposes. But why is it dangerous? Well, you should not expect software bundles to contain supremely useful applications. Most often, those will be things like system triggers, driver updaters, apps that change system visuals, in short, software of questionable quality and usefulness. Another problem with bundled software is that it often conceals the option to disable the installation of these additional programs. And that is actually the part that SAPDOT is responsible for. Considering that the user expects to install one program and in fact gets several other ones, the case is already suboptimal, but the programs installed in that way may add even more problems. At best, they will just interrupt you from time to time with their windows, scans and whatnot. At worst, they can mangle some of the important system settings and render the entire system malfunctioning and be daring enough to ask you to pay for the license to fix that mess up. One more disturbing thing surfaced after analyzing the activity logs of SAPDOT. It turns out that this unwanted app drops a DLL somewhere in the system folders and creates the hooks that allow it to start along with the system. As a result, SAPDOT will be able to deploy unwanted apps later on. During the test, I did not encounter any signs of such behavior, but, well, these tests were not long-lasting to begin with. Okay, now let's talk about the removal. Considering the amount of unwanted apps and the persistence gaining behavior that I've just mentioned, manual removal is barely an option. Even for a tech-savvy user, it will be an endeavor worth several hours of time, leave alone someone who is not that skilled in digging through Windows guts. With brilliant soft and time malware, on the other hand, you will get rid of all the dangerous things in just a few minutes. Run a standard scan to check the typical locations where unwanted programs can store their files. That will take about 5 minutes. After the scan, click Clean Now to remove the detected threats. Due to the number of files that unwanted programs have created in the system, the removal may also take a minute or two. Now the system is clean. Good luck and stay safe online.